What's going on YouTube? KG4FJC with the hat. <laughs> I just like doing that. Uh, today we're going to do a real quickie on how to get Supermon running on your uh, All-Star node. Um, a lot of y'all probably heard what Supermon, some of you, I mean a lot of y'all probably played with it, but for those that haven't, Supermon is a web interface for your All-Star node. So you can do point and click stuff uh, on your web browser from either your local computer or outside your uh, your home network uh, from your smartphone or tablet, computer, or whatever. As long as you have web access, you can get in and control your node, which is a very cool thing. comes in very handy. Um, let's take a look. So this right here, this is uh, the uh, Supermon page for uh, 47046, the uh, KG4 HOT system here. Um, uh, down here, you can see we've got um, nodes. These are all the nodes that are connected, okay? And a lot of this because I just reset the node not too long ago. Um, all these up here are your buttons to do different things with the uh, node itself. Uh, configuration editor brings up uh, your files on the Pi. Um, all kinds of cool stuff. Um, you can see your connection log, who's connected and when, and when they disconnected, all that stuff. It's a very cool thing to have. But this is just a, a basic how to set it up and get it up and running. We'll go through a different video of actually doing all of the the customizing and stuff on there. So first thing we're going to do is head over to uh, hamvoip.org. And again, down at the bottom, or towards the bottom, you'll see Supermon Setup. Another PDF. Again, Doug and the gang have done all the work. I'm just doing a video on what they've done. Okay. So step one, create a password for all mine. Okay. So we're going to do my famous copy and paste. Um, you're going to you know, log in for SSH. All right. Here. And then we're going to nano manager.conf. Okay, now let's scroll down, all right, and the PDF walks you through it. The admin stands up right here, all right, we're going to add a password. What this is for is this is basically the password that your web server is going to use to access the all-star part of your, of your node. Um, We'll set up a different username and password to actually log in from outside. This is sets up what it's used on inside. So let's do the password. And yeah, I'm going to change all these, but for this, we're going to do it this way. We're going to put Jason. Ooh, hard one there. All right. Control exit. Yes, you want to save. Yes, that file. Now, A-S-T-R-E-S dot S-H. We want to restart the node. Okay, we'll restart asterisk. All right, I'll go back here. So we've already done that. Next thing we need to do is we need to get into this directory right here. It's the Supermon directory. All right, boom, boom, boom. Now we're going to nano allmon.ini. Okay. We're not going to worry about the stuff down here right now. All right. The very first one, put your node number in here. Okay. I think you, by default is 1998. Um, so change this to your node number. Okay. Then right here, make sure this says admin, just like, uh, like the stanza said in the last part we did. All right. Password. This has to be the same password that you put in there. Ooh, hard one again, right? All right, control X, yes, enter. All right, now well, I can't remember the next step, and I've done this a hundred times. All right, this is where it's kind of fun. Okay, we're gonna do the password. I see it says create a password for you and possibly others to log in. It should say create a login and password because this is gonna make the login and password when you access it via the web, okay? So we should already be in this directory right here. All right, if not, make sure you're in that directory. All right, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make the, the username. Again, this will be the username that you use to log in from your web browser. All right, so we're gonna paste this right here. I'm gonna back this up. 
All right, I'm gonna put Jason as the username, okay? Because that's me. Actually, you know what? No. Let's put KG4FJC as the username, okay? Enter. Now we need to make a password for KG4FJC. I'm gonna do this one the same just because it's easy. Then retype the same password. Okay. Now we should be basically done. So if we start a new tab, 192.168.43.202 forward slash supermon. All right. Now up here in the top corner, and oh, this, let me back up. I, since I'm on the same network as my Pi, this is uh, this is the IP address of the Pi. All right, so you're always going to log in on port 80, well, by stock and default. Um, the IP address, the local IP address of your Pi. Um, maybe we'll get into different stuff later as far as accessing it from outside your network. Um, but this will get you into your Pi. See, this page is being created on the on the node. Up here in the top left, let's click login. All right, and KG4FJC. All right. And that one, and we'll see if my login works. Hey, it changed in. Yep. So now, if we go here, click on the node number at the top, 471461. You can see I have no connections. I don't even know if the thing's online. It should be. Uh, let's see if I can connect to a buddy's node. It's a Mr. Tim's node there. We'll see if it connects. I don't know if it will or not, because I've been playing. Yeah, so my internet's all hosed. But anyway, regardless, this is uh, now what you have. So see, it's listing the CPU temp and all that stuff. Um, kind of cool. Uh, again, we'll go through setting all this other stuff later. Um, you go to the configuration editor. Um, actually, you know what? Let's go to... Where is it at? Control. This will open up another page here. All right. Say link status. Um, let's see. Say time of day locally. The time is 3.31 p.m. There you go. And now it's doing the ID and all that. Um, so functioning, it's it's working. But uh, look around at, at everything that's here. Um, yeah, be careful, but um, yeah, just look around at, at the stuff you've got here and uh, see what you got to play with. Um, that's it. Uh, that's how you basic uh, basically get, well, that is how you get Supermon on your node. Um, that's just very basic, 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 basic to get it up and going. Um, again, we'll play with all this other stuff uh, a little bit later and uh, go from there. But uh, anyway, for now, 7-3, check us out, 47046.